Hey everybody, what's going on? Dustin here with another NASCAR diecast review. Now, I understand it took me a little while forever to uh, get some of these reviews out, and I do apologize for that whatsoever. So, I am back, but it's not going to be uh, long enough because I do do have a feeling I may cut the uh, the NASCAR diecast series a little bit shorter than usual, as originally scheduled. I do apologize on on that one as well. So, so today's diecast review, we're taking a look at one of the first 2023 diecast cards that I got. Actually, this I got from the uh, the Speedway from Atlanta Motor Speedway back in uh, in July. So, if you like to check out that vlog, check out both vlogs, the Xfinity series and the uh, Cup series vlogs. I will link leave links down in the description below, or click on the card on the top corner of your screen. So here is the uh, the Kevin Harvick Bush Light Forever a Champion card. This is basically Kevin Harvick's final season. So you know what? I might as well do a review on one of his cars from this year. So this is the Bush Light scheme. And actually it looks very, very grand. So so we have the number four Bush Light beer, the 2023 Ford Mustang. And it is a limited edition adult collectible. This will have the... Uh, and also, if you actually do notice, it does have a NASCAR 75th anniversary. If it can focus. Should focus, like, come on. There we go. It has a NASCAR 75th anniversary logo. So without further ado, without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and take this car up off of its packaging. I'll be right back. Well, I did call it perfectly. It does have that, uh, it does have that uh, display stand on the bottom. And also, also, I did not purchase this from Circle V Diecast. If anybody's wondering, I did purchase this from the Atlanta Motor Speedway gift shop. Now, in case of anyone's wondering about the price... $15. I mean, seriously, $15 for this little car? Like, for real? Like, that's possibly one of the main reasons I'm actually getting out of the uh, the hobby just for a little while. Just to catch up on uh, on bills and stuff. So, so, that way I can get back into it a little bit later on. So, so I'm not going to go. So, here's the, uh, the car itself. This beautiful bush beer. Bush light scheme. As we can see, the full front of the Ford Mustang. I really love the other metallic blue and the and the silver just really pops out. So here's the Bush Light logo. And we got the metallic silver on the backdrop with the number four. Let me do this real quick. Got Mobile One on here, got Harvick's name. We got Stuart Haas Racing on the front bumper. And we'll also, we can take a look at the sides. Now we do have the uh, the Goodyear racing tire, and we also have the uh, the NASCAR Cup Series, and also the NASCAR 75th Anniversary logo, the Diamond Anniversary. At number four, we've got the Bush Light can on here. Got Kevin Harvick's name up on the name rail. We got Bush Light on here, also Mobile One. We got Gear Wrench on the C Post. And we got some team associated sponsors. We got Haas Automations, Pristine Auctions, Hunt Brothers Pizza. On the back, we have Bush Light, Mobile One, the uh, Ford Manufacturer Plate. And also, we got Bush Light on here as well. And of course, the other side is the same way now. Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do about basically about this uh, display stand on the bottom. Basically, this is from the uh, the retailer. They're allowed to do this, but unfortunately, it's a bummer for real. Like, if they could just do like a second version of this and put like Harvick's name on here, that'd be great. That'd be like great for the kids. Let 
and here's the other side the same way so of course the underside is just a flat black just riveted onto just plastic riveted on a die cast metal and can't forget about the wheels though also made out of plastic as well i may one day try to find one with rubber tires and actually do a review of that so that'd be actually pretty sweet i think i did one back in the past but i can't remember so yeah so this ride right here very amazing you know Har harvick's final season so basically gotta do a at least a review of one of his cars. Because I've done so many of them, I think it's actually time to do at least do a review of them. And don't worry that top 10 Kevin Harvick diecast cars is actually going to be in the works. I know I did put it on the back burner for a little while, so basically that will come out in November. And I think that'd be all for this review anyway. So if you happen to like this video, leave a like, comment on here, subscribe for more NASCAR diecast reviews. I try to publish them out in the best way that I can. I am a Circle B Diecast affiliate. Use coupon code Kruger at checkout for $5 off shipping on all orders $30 or more. And if you're not one of those that watch my videos but is not subscribed, please consider hitting that subscribe button. And also tap that bell for post notifications as well. You'll be notified every single time I upload. So anyway... We'll take care of that. So anyway, my name is Dustin, and I'll see you guys in another video real soon.